Hello everyone. Uh, at the very outset, I would like to welcome you all to Beyond Programming. Uh, the best part about this particular workshop is that uh, it is happening at the beginning of the year. So it's it's actually going to set the tone for the rest of the year, and from there on, you can obviously you can take ahead. So welcome to Beyond Programming workshop. What I'm going to talk today. I'm going to talk today about intention setting and I'm before uh, I'm before setting an intention uh, there would be a small exercise that would be required by us to be done so I'm going to talk so I'm going to just brief you about that exercise and uh, and then I'll talk a little bit about uh, setting an intention okay so just imagine that uh, you are uh, you are an architect or uh, someone who is in the field of construction and that you build buildings structures things like that uh, you have received a project to build a building to build a new building okay uh, in place of a in place of a building which is dilapidated uh, which is not used so as a, so as an architect or or as a construction person what what basically you would do is that you will go to that place you will you will take a survey of it uh, you will then you will use bulldozers laborers whatever it is you will remove the old building totally altogether that is you will remove your debris then what else you would do is that you would dig deep into that place so that the so that the base is strong and on a very strong base the structure would be raised so my main aim of this particular short video over here is to help you remove the debris and one of the one of the exercises that we are going to do over here is of uh, writing down writing down on a piece of paper whatever are your negative thoughts whatever is your negative self-talk uh, whatever is your uh, whatever has been your trauma just just start scribbling down if you were bullied some at some point of time in your life if someone had ever hurt you uh, if you are embarrassed by something if you feel that you are not being loved enough whatever is your whatever are your reservations uh, whatever gives you less confidence in life just start scribbling down just start scribbling down on a piece of paper uh, the basic idea of this particular exercise is to is to bring up on the surface all those things which are deep inside your consciousness and uh, it will come uh, it will come on the ulterior and from the ulterior side and from the ulterior then what we are going to do is we are going to completely remove it from our system that is from our neurology that is there will perhaps be no memory of it at all. This is a very important exercise for uh, Beyond Programming because over here in Beyond Programming, one of the most one of the important things that we are going to learn is that uh, how to install new behaviors. So let us not uh, try to install new behaviors uh, wherein our base, our platform is having a little bit of debris or it's not dig deep. One important point I want to tell you over here is that when you start writing down and when you finish, uh, please do not read it again. Because if you read it again, then you are reaffirming to yourself whatever you have written down. We don't want to reaffirm ourselves whatever we have written down. We just want to bring it on the surface and we just want to remove it from the system by just writing it down on a piece of paper. This exercise you can do two times three times just suit yourself and you can stop when you feel that yeah, now I just feel good inside it's uh, it's okay I uh, I am now okay being with my uh, with, with my own self and I don't get those feelings anymore after that whatever piece of paper that you have uh, it is important that uh, you can it is important that you part ways with it Parting ways is, is very is very symbolical. So what I would like to do is I would like to just ideally tear it up uh, into few pieces and then burn it. Burning it burning it is very symbolic for me. Uh, you can do something like that. If you just want to tear it and throw it away, it's simply up to you. 
what is more important to achieve over here is a state of mind wherein i feel that i don't get those traumas anymore i don't feel that bad anymore that is the main objective <clears throat> next thing is is setting an intent uh, now when i talk about setting an intent with uh, i would like to explain it to you in a with an example uh, in whichever room you are sitting right now and listening to this video just uh, just see if you can see red color okay now immediately your eyes will start uh, start uh, having a gaze uh, has will start searching around the room for red color and you will find uh, you will find red color now around the red color there would be many other colors but the, but you have set an intent to find only the red color now when i told you please find red color in the room i want you to note down what all things went into your neurology what all things flashed into your mind uh, how it felt into your new neurology and most importantly you had a clarity you really had clarity of what red color looks like what you are looking forward for you you had clarity of how red color will look like that is the clarity with respect to your intention so for 2022 if your intent is i want to get i want to get healthy if health is your intention let's have more clarity on that okay so on a piece of paper maybe you can just write down what are what all are your intentions let's start with health only if you say that uh, my intention is to become healthy then there are many more parameters in it when you say you want to become healthy how exactly you what exactly you mean by that do you mean that uh, you just want to lose weight uh, do you mean that you had some some uh, some physical ailments like uh, Uh, like there was a knee problem or uh, there was some pain in the shoulder that you want to overcome just make a just make a list of uh, just just make a list of what exactly do you want to achieve okay and in front of that start writing down how you will achieve it okay now with this exercise what we are basically achieving is that the universe is constantly listening to us believe it or not the our thoughts our uh, our emotions that we exhibit uh, are being are being received by the universe and that is what the universe is constantly delivering to us so our situations our uh, uh, the developments which are happening around uh, around us is all because of uh, our thoughts our way of thinking pattern so with this particular exercise you are setting uh, you are telling the universe that this is exactly what i want and how i am going to achieve this thing and what you will soon see is that the universe will start responding to what you have written down now once the universe starts responding to what you have written down it's time for you to take action that's the biggest that's the biggest step that you will have to take take action you have already taken one big action by signing up for the workshop for which i would like to congratulate you once again and please do this exercise i'll see you in the class thank you